Welcome to the daily video update on this stormy Thursday afternoon at the Unitarian Church of Lincoln. Today is June 18th, 2020. This week we're talking about three roles that the church plays in the, role, in the world. The priestly role, the prophetic role, and the pastoral. Yesterday we talked about the priestly role, how the Unitarian Church of Lincoln, even in the midst of a global pandemic, still is present in ritual, making, marking the changes in people's lives. Today we're going to talk about the prophetic role. This is in some ways where Unitarian Universalism writ large has been the most comfortable or at least the most present over the last few years. The prophetic role is one that claims from a place of faith that the world we live in and the world that we ought to inhabit are different, that something is wrong in the world and we have a responsibility to address, us, to address it. That's very much in our wheelhouse as a tradition. Every time the Social Justice Committee puts together a right here, right now letter writing campaign, every time we show up at a committee event calling for justice, every time we put a sign in front of our house saying a better world is possible, that is the church being prophetic in the world. And we know that being prophetic is not just about proclamation, it is also about how we act in quiet moments of hope or a decision not to allow guns in our building or putting in solar panels during a renovation. Moments that break down the division between the world as it is and the world as it ought to be. There is also legitimately some, some real tension in the prophetic role. Because part of this role, this legacy, is pointing out where we have fallen short. And that's true of prophets in scripture, that's true of prophetic moments now. Pointing out the gulf between the world as it is and the world as it ought to be requires a critique of the world as it is. And for those of us for whom the world as it is is a comfortable, mostly happy place, and I'm very much including myself in that, that critique is often uncomfortable. The fly in the ointment asking us, what is the cost of your comfort? And despite how hard that is, it is necessary. And the last piece that I want to say uh, is this. The prophetic piece can often feel like the most important, the most present role of both the minister and the church, particularly in Unitarian Universalism in 2020. But it is not the only role. One of the reasons that we can be effective in our justice work is that it's not the only thing that we do. We also do the priestly work. We mark major moments in the lives of individuals and in the life of community. And we do the pastoral work of caring for each other as individuals and as a community, which is where we'll pick up tomorrow. And that, I think, is what distinguishes the church from the prophets in in scripture and in tradition. We have other roles. So our critique of the world as it is, is always in the context of a generational community. It is always tied to a lived experience of being part of that world. And that's a, that's a tension at times, but it's what makes churches unique, that we can hold both of those things at the same time. So I'll see you tomorrow when we wrap this up. And until then, it's Thursday night, so uh, I will see you in worship this evening. There'll be a link to the Zoom um, worship service in your eblast along with this video. Have a great night, everybody. Oh, and hopefully uh, there'll be some more light tomorrow so it doesn't look like I'm doing a daily update in the middle of a cave. All right, see you tomorrow.